it's time for me to call another tech support scammer. This time, however, we're going to use a remote administration tool called Trollrat, made by Lorak, the same person who made um, the memes Trojan, which I've made three videos about. I've already put syskey on this VM to save the scammers the trouble. The password is cunt, by the way. And this virtual machine takes a, quite a long time to start up because it's on my external hard drive, which is not a, which is not an SSD. And I've already set it up to make it look like a noob's laptop uh, with a lot of crap programs on it, like some booster programs that crap like that. Also, I made up a fake some fake documents, saved them all to the desktop. And yeah, stuff like that. And I'm going to load Troll Rat and uh, control the virtual machine while the scammer is trying to use it. But I've already run into a problem. I have no idea what number to call. So I'm going to try looking around on the internet for a while. If I can't find anything, I'm going to... I'm gonna look on Lewis's text Discord server and we'll see if we can find uh, a number to call and it has to be toll free because I because I don't have any Skype credit this is the preview version of Skype that comes with Windows 10 anniversary update looks different has this section about bots I have no idea how it works, I just opened it uh, to hide my contacts. Anyway, here's the keypad, it has to be a total free number as I said. And we'll wait until this virtual machine is ready to be used. And I have the icons organized differently, let's see if I can fix this. Beautiful. Anyway, let's try finding someone to call. I'm not really prepared for this. Oh, we... yeah, of course. Forgot to set up Troll Rat. I have a shortcut for it. Where is it? It's called Johnny Test. There it is. I know nothing about Johnny Test except uh, it's a funny name. Anyway, I think Troll Rat is running now. It doesn't say anything. Yep. It's running in the background. And the networking is set as NAT. But you can still use Trollrat this way. We'll find the IP address for this VM. There it is. You add colon 1337 at the end. And there you go. There's the Trollrat uh, user interface. And here you can pretty much screw around with the computer. I have a secondary monitor, I'm gonna move the, this window there in a second, but I'll show you something real quick. Firefox is a bit glitched up, but doesn't matter. I don't know, for example, message boxes. I'm gonna do random error messages. Windows. Message box icon, random. And it does it once every second. I'm gonna press start, and it's gonna open uh, random error messages. I can make it go faster, like like one hundredth of a second. That's gonna screw up the VM, so better stop that. But yeah. As you can see that worked. Close open windows. You can you can close all, all the alerts at once. Provided I didn't screw it up. No, it's they're closing. There you go. Most of these are the payloads of the meme Trojan, like random key input, move cursor, screen glitches. Yeah. But you can customize them. For example, move cursor. On memes, you can customize that. But here, I can set it. For example, you know, hundred. Start. 
as you can see the mouse cursor is moving a lot and it's pretty much impossible to control the computer this way well I can on this virtual machine but this camera isn't gonna be isn't going to be able to use it one of my favorite effects is screen glitches I'm gonna set it to do as quick as possible, maximum rectangle size, that's fine. And glitch power, it's gonna leave it as two. Click start. And it feels like putting your screen in a blender. I love this, uh, this effect. Yeah, it's not happening very quickly, but um, you can do it uh, a little bit quicker. Well, faster computer. And yeah, that's it. Let's look for scammers. Let's try YouTube with two O's. Oops, Internet Explorer could not find it. Wait, that's from Google Toolbar. Screw you. Is there a way to disable this custom page? I don't know. Maybe that doesn't work. Like Facebook with an E. My push code. Get today's offers online. Click the button to get started. That's not a virus. That's not a virus alert. I should learn to say these words properly, you know. Those beeps were coming from the Play System Sounds payloader. Because this is a Windows 7 Lite virtual machine, it doesn't have any of the Windows System Sounds. Oh, that's way too long. Let's just check it out on Discord. I'm not sure if the pronunciation is Discord or Discord. Because I was messing with Siri on my iPhone and it said Discord. And I know that's a pretty good text to speech voice, but I'm not sure if it's saying it correctly. Like, like, hear it for yourself. What are my notifications? You have notifications from Discord, Flipboard, Instagram, Pinterest, Timehop, and Twitter. You have one notification from Discord. Lurik's public Discord development Xenix at Lurik. What do the plugins for Troll Rat have to be developed in? There are more. Shall I read them all? No. Okay. Obviously, Siri didn't pronounce plugins right, so maybe it's pronouncing the Discord wrong as well. Anyway, let's see. Scammer numbers. Ah, oh, damn, it's broken. Microsoft official support. There, oh, there you go. That's a nice alert. Plus 44. What country code is that? I'm not going to try pronouncing that. Let's see if it's toll free. I don't even know what that country is. Is it toll free? Yep, it says it's toll free. Let's see if we can call it through Skype. Train elevator effect, what does that do? Oh, should be a little slower actually. Let's see, 20. Nope. Has to be like really subtle. No, let's try a hundred. Just that's just less smooth. So let's see. One. Yeah, that's subtle. So that could work. Move cursor. Yeah, I'm gonna enable that sometimes. Screen glitches. Tunnel effect. Mm. Reverse text. That would be interesting. 
drawers. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do that. That's that looks too much like a prank. Draw pixels on on screen. Does that do? I haven't tried it yet. Oh, oh, I get it. Hmm. Earthquake. Nice. Yeah, basically, I should just run these all at once. Okay, so are we ready? Got troll rat on the other monitor. Got this nice error, which is totally legit. Can click. I probably can't click the X, but I'm gonna try it. It's my beautiful VM. Yep. Tetra Kiss 3,5 bistrifluoromethylphenoborate. It's not too hard to pronounce. Anyway, provided that this Skype preview app works properly and this number is still in service, I'm gonna try calling them and messing with the computer with Troll Rat. What? The user you are trying to reach is unavailable. Damn it. Number is no longer in service. So I can't use this. Let's try one more time. User you are trying to reach is unavailable. That's, that's the that's the sound when someone calls you on Skype. Why is it making that sound? Anyway, that's, that number doesn't work, so... Oh, oh, I thought I could close it. Of course I can't. I move it. Fake Google Chrome. Alert. Yeah. Well, I can still use this, but when they see the number is not the same. I don't know what, what they're going to say. Let's see if there's another one. How do I close it? I have to force quit, don't I? Close the window. Doesn't work, I have to end it from task manager. There you go. That's not... That's the official Microsoft website, what the hell? I probably fix this too. Damn it, if I don't have a proper. I think I already tried this. No, not the IRS cameras. I prefer the, the computer ones. Or hard drive safety. Ooh. Important security message. Please call the number provided as soon as possible. <laughs> you will be guided for the removal of the adware spyware virus on your computer. Seeing these pop-ups means that you have a virus installed on your computer which puts the security of your This is a text to speech voice I know but it's strongly advised. Don't know where it's from but I think I've used it in the past. Anyway. What's the country call for this? US, I'm guessing. Wouldn't that be 1 800? Oh, that's probably United Kingdom. So, what's like, what's that like? Plus 44? Shut up, bitch. No, 44 is that. Isn't 43? No? I totally forgot. It's 40 something, I know. Important security message. Please call the number provided as soon as possible. Nope. Plus thirty-three. Nope. The removal of the adware spyware virus on your computer. Seeing these pop-ups means that you have a thirty-nine is Italy. Should know that. Puts the security of your personal data at a serious risk. What's plus forty something? Plus four three three. Nope. Oh, don't remember. I'm just gonna look it up. Important security message. Plus 44? Oh, I don't know. Let's just try it. Thank you for calling Westfield Dining Customer Support. This call may be recorded for quality assurance purposes. 
Please wait for the next available agent. You may press 1 at any time to leave a message, and we will return your call when the next agent becomes available. I'm getting tired now. Anyway, even if these, even if no one's gonna answer, you've seen what Troll Rat is like. There isn't a public download link for it yet, but you can download it if you join Loirak's Discord server. It's working because it says it's ready. Kind of losing my patience. I don't know if I should upload this video, but it's gonna give more attention to Loirak, which which he deserves because he's because he's a really good programmer. And antiviruses can't detect this yet, so that's a bonus. Oh no! What's this? Is the robotic lady still talking? Yup. Personal data at a serious risk. It's strongly advised that you call the number provided and get your computer fixed. Yeah, Shopping what? Online. Oh. Important security message. Shut up. Oh no, I can't close it. Close. Well, well that's weird. Windows has detected that your computer's performance is slow. Oh, scammers would love to see this. Keep the current car scheme, change the car scheme. Oh, this is the first time in my life I'm seeing this on my own computer. That's so cool. Now I'll keep the color, the current color scheme. Oh. Call ended. Six minutes. The call quality was good, but whatever. So thanks for watching this failed tech support scam baiting video. Could probably look for some other numbers, but. I think I've done a long enough video. If I feel the need to to call tech support scammers again, I'll do another video and I will use Troll Rat again because it's, it's quite cool. But to get rid of this, you can just force quit it from Task Manager, but I'm just gonna power off the VM because it doesn't really matter what its health is. Now this is not going to connect anymore. By the way, you can even run this on your main computer. It won't harm it. Uh, and to exit, you, and, to, and to quit this, you just um, end this from Task Manager. Sorry if this video was kind of lame, but I can always make another one if I have the chance to talk to tech support scammers again. I'm not really good at this. There are other people who can do it much better than me, but if you want, I can try again. Let me know in the comments. Thank you for watching again, and I'll see you in another video.